Hello again, this is Robert Feach here. And this is my video review of a 600 watt equivalent grow light from a company called Enjo Yield. E-N-J-O-Y-I-E-L-D. Now this is the equivalent of 600 watts, but it only uses 120 watts. We're gonna test that uh, in a couple minutes here. So this is a unique LED grow light. It's full spectrum. So it has infrared and ultraviolet mixed in. And it's spliceable. As you see right here, there is a cable you can put to daisy chain this. Uh, you could have up to eight of these units and they're very slim. This is a really unique profile. So let's just show the other side right here. I'm going to go over all the features of this. There is the LED array. And these are the latest tech, they're SMD LED, surf surface mount. And you see there's a blend of LEDs in there. Some of these you're not gonna see with your naked eye, and those are the infrared ones, so don't be concerned about that. But it's a really nice blend of different wavelengths, and they show that. So it's about 380 nanometers to 740 nanometers to get that full spectrum. And this will illuminate up to a two foot by two foot growing area. If you need more, you can put them in series or parallel. And the um, included instruction manual does show you how to mount them in series and in parallel right here. It has very detailed information about that in case you want to expand this and get more uh, larger surface area. The company provides a full two year warranty and a 30 day money back guarantee and 24 hour customer support on Amazon. Now I'll show something else. This is input ports for air, right there and right there. And that's the output. There's two fans in here that have ball bearings, very long life. So you see on both sides, it has those fans. We're gonna test the thermal capability of that also. And then on the part, part right here on both sides, you can see there is aluminum oversized heat sink along with this piece right here. This is where you hang it from. That's gonna allow dissipation of that surface mount LEDs that I showed on the front. And those fans will last a long time. They're high quality like what's in a computer. So what that does is it's gonna give, give you the best heat dissipation by combining the heat sink with the air flowing through on both sides and the two fans. What that's gonna do is gonna protect these surface mount LEDs because heat is the most damaging thing to LEDs. They're not like incandescent bulbs, heat will damage them. So we're taking that heat away from here by using the heat sink and those fans and that, that adds to the long life of, these, of this product. This product only weighs 3.3 pounds and it's very slim profile as I show and included is mounting to mount the light and also some hardware if you want to put more of these in series, which is nice. And a little hex tool to tighten these hex nuts right here. And also you could use hex nuts, hex nuts between the devices themselves to set them up that way in series or parallel. And again, the directions go over that very nicely, very well written. And includes a US plug right here, allow you to power the unit. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to power this up and see what it looks like. So to power it up, it's very simple. It has this included very nice flexible power cord with a US plug on there. And it looks like it's just a little over six feet. So we're just going to plug it in right there and you have your power switch right there. So I'm going to plug this end in into 115 volts. And now let's turn the unit on. And you get that instant full spectrum color out of it which looks so unique now let, we're, we're going to let this run we're going to do some tests on it um, but I, right away i hear the fans if you listen and that's what's cooling off those very bright leds now if i put it like this i could feel some of the air coming out of here and some of the air entering here. So let's let this run. We'll do some thermal tests on it. But while this is plugged in, let's do a simple test to see 
how much power it is consuming. Let's go to watts. So you can see my watt meter is showing that it is 105 watts. So that means that your electric bill is going to be very little small because 105 watts is not bad at all considering that this is producing the equivalent of a tungsten 600 watt output. So that's the first test right there. So it's very low power. So I have the light running for about uh, 40 minutes here. So I'm going to do some temperature checks. So I'm going to go along, along the LED array. I get 134 degrees. So that's where the, the bulk of the heat is in front of the LEDs. The fans are helping to cool it. If I go to the back of the unit right here, now let's take a look at the heat sink area right there. And you see that's running 127 degrees. And what that's telling me is that the heat sink is doing its job. It's dissipating the heat from those LEDs. And then the actual fans themselves are producing and removing some of the heat also because the air coming out of there is only about 94 degrees. So that's a good sign. So the fans combined with the large heat sink area on both sides is cooling the array off, doing what it should do, which will keep the life of those LED bulbs really long lasting. So what's my overall opinion about the Enjoy Yield 600 watt equivalent LED roll light, full spectrum, very small profile with really nice fans and running cool. I like this product. I love the profile of this. This is the first grow light I've ever tested that has this commercial high quality feel to it. It feels like something in a research lab. I worked in research for many years for AT&T Bell Laboratories. This feels like a high quality research product. So I really think you're gonna like this product. You saw how it grew my seedlings very rapidly. So I'm gonna give this product a full five star rating on my channel. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you learn to new video uploads. And if you like this review, please hit the like button. I hope the information I presented helps you with your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.